Hey guys, in this video we are going to be taking a look at Middleman, which is a really cool, really small library that lets you kind of hijack any other third party library. Uh, so on the page here I've got Middleman, I've also got jQuery. Now Middleman does not depend on jQuery, uh, jQuery is the library that we're going to go ahead and hijack. Uh, so I'm going to throw an unordered list here on the page and uh, let's see, I'm going to have these list items, I'm going to give them a class of foo, inner content of foo, I'm going to do six of those, uh, however, on the second three, I'm going to change this to not foo. Okay, so here in our script, we are going to just kind of standard uh, jQuery DOM ready function here, we're going to say dollar dot each, oops, and we're going to select the foos. So dot foo, and uh, then we're going to go through those, and so that's uh, index and item. And here, we're just going to mess with the CSS a little bit. So I'm going to take the item, I'm going to say CSS, I'm going to make the color red. Okay, so let's load that up really quick. Oh, that didn't work. So, oh, you know what? There we go. Okay, so you can see that it turned each of the foos, uh, it didn't turn them, but it gave each of them a CSS color of red. Now what we're gonna do is set up our middleman. So I'm gonna say var mm equals new, whoops, new middle, uh, I think that's a lowercase n, m, sorry. Uh, so there's our middleman instantiated. I'm gonna say mm dot map, and inside of this, I'm going to drop in an object. Now, I'm going to identify the library with this lib uh, key. That's going to be dollar sign in our case for jQuery. And I'm going to uh, tell it what method I want to uh, kind of attach myself to. And that's going to be a string, but we're identifying the each method. Uh, then we're going to filter our, uh, so we're going to say function, and we're going to grab, whoops, as an argument, we're going to grab the args, the arguments from the uh, from the each function, and then uh, all we're going to do is we're going to take the args, and I'm going to take the first one, and I'm going to change it. So I'm going to say it equals uh, not foo, and I'm just going to return my args object. Whoops. Okay. So let's check that out in the browser, reload it. And now you can see that we basically, when each was called, we uh, changed this first argument, the zero positioned argument from uh, dot not, or from dot foo to dot not foo. So uh, there you go. That's a quick look at middleman. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hope you have a good one.